Hey guys, I'm going to be doing a video on how to um, just really secure your files very easily and securely on Windows. I found this on a uh, web page while uh, searching for something else and it came up. So I thought of uh, checking it out. So the way to do it is, uh, first, you'll have to uh, go to a link in the description that I'll put. Me. Okay, so here we go. So first you would have to create a folder, which I don't know why you have to. You don't really have to. Uh, you should just go to step two immediately. So what I did was uh, I created a text document, and you just copy all this in. So I have mine here. Um, si since you can't right-click and open with something, just add, drag and drop, and there you go. So you would copy that in. And then where it says password goes here, here you would put your um, your password. So wherever it was here, just highlight it like if it would be like this. Highlight that and then change it. I'm gonna go don't save. And once that is done, you would have to go and finish. You go file save as and it says and put locker dot bat bat and not as a text document but all files because you want it to save as a dot bat as another um, file type dot bat is an executable which is just like in installing any, so any other software on windows which is what what it says um, yeah just save it where you want I already saved it so I'm not gonna save it again then you double click and you enter the password for it and it'll bring it up private I already has stuff inside it and it's already private so just double click it and you have your stuff you can put uh, whatever stuff uh, you want in here and then to just secure it or lock it double click on it again and you say yes or no y or n to lock it so if I go n I click enter it will lock it it, it won't disappear so you click um, why enter and it'll make it disappear right there and there you go that's how you securely lock something it's like like hiding files in their properties like if you go properties here then you go hidden then you go apply and okay and you can't see it anymore but then you can just simply go out if you don't have it already tools folder options view and show hidden files and folders and drives apply okay and it would be here and then you can right click properties and undo it and then you can double click it again and you'll have it that's just another one but people can easily find it like that if you want so uh... yeah that's how that's how i have it um, please like this video if you enjoyed it i know this is something trying to do something uh, new like um, not like the other tech um, people do on YouTube, um, something new and original. Uh, uh, click, click the like button down below, subscribe for more videos uh, like this on tech and new and original tech things. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace.